peelers, crack and packs and counting stacks. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Like the video if you enjoy the content. Share it out to your favorite social media for us. Feel free to follow us on any of our social medias. They are in the description. So today we have a mail day of straight garbage pail kids. I'm going to go over a few things. We got a nice care package from our good friend GPK Nick. Appreciate you, buddy. And as always, the envelope is uh, sketched up. I don't want you to see the address. And I'm not cutting off the uh, label this time because last time I junked the envelope and I'm trying to avoid that this time. Even the artwork that Nick sends is just straight, or the envelopes Nick sends is just straight artwork. Make you want to frame it. So these are the Topps uh, Wacky Packages. I order these every week um, just to try and, you know, get the sets, collect them, maybe in the future. Still GPK related, Simi. Tops is just money grabbing like a mofo. So we got the wacky packages artists and we got the wacky packages going wacky. And I'm going to open these, kind of do a quick rundown, and then I'll show you the other crazy stuff that we got here. So here's the base cards. Roman, Doll, Vlasic, Queasy Dill. So there's the uh, Heath Bar variation. And aged old dog food. <laughs> That's fire. So aged old dog food on the back. Wonky packages. That's pretty cool. And then this one has the uh, Artist of the Week in it, John Zelenik. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at what we got here. So same thing, basic set. We got the doll. Uh, yeah, Ludlow Red back. Beautiful. And then we got Silt, like soy milk, pukeable. That one's good, man. And that's the guest artist uh, wacky package. So that's pretty cool, man. I like those. All right, let's get to these crazy hits that I've got here. Let's see what we're working with here. Yeah. So I ordered this uh, through one of the marketplace uh, sales. Paid a little more than I wanted to, but that's okay, man. Adam Goldberg celebrity shirt relic with the Adam Bomb card up top from the 30th anniversary. Wanted to pick this bad boy up just because it's cool. I'm friends with Adam Goldberg on Facebook, so he was like, oh, yeah, bro. I said, hopefully there's no mustard on it. You know, he said it was from camp, so I asked him if there was mustard on it. So that's a pretty cool one to add to the collection. This, I don't know how I got so lucky on this, um, but this is this is nice. This is nice. There's my knife. So we're going to cut the tape. I got lucky. I saw this as a suggestion on eBay, and I bought it as quickly as I possibly could. Boxing Glover. Garbage Pail Kids, autographed, PSA, DNA certified by Manny Pacquiao, man. So talk about a crossover there. I just couldn't resist this. This thing was beautiful. It wasn't that expensive. Um, 2015 top set. It, it, I just couldn't resist. So it is autographed. It's not graded, but the card is in really friggin' good condition. I guess they just didn't want to pay for the grading as well. But that's Boxing Glover, Manny Pacquiao, PSA, DNA certified. Well, that's a nice one I'm adding to my collection. This is the only coin I was able to get <laughs> because they sell out so fast. Tried buying them the other day. Had the uh, three-pack or the three-card set or three coin set in my cart, expressed, PayPal, checkout, and you want to know what? Sold out before the screen could even buffer. There's our Adolescent Adam signed GPK card. Nice little auto, says happy 35th on it. It's really cool, man. It's very cool. Happy with that. And then we have our challenge coin. So the only one I was able to get was challenge coin number three. I'm not taking it out of the package. <laughs> Number 33 of 100. These are beautifully made. They're super heavy too, man. So I did get my hands on coin number three. So I guess I'll have a number three set of the golds today. Uh, well, yeah. When this video airs, it will be a few days ago. So we're going to get to the GPK Nick selection. Shane can't resist. The guy's a beast artist. I hope Tops keeps him under contract, renews him forever uh, because his artwork is sick and stuff like this that he does for the fans man he sketches the outside of the envelope any of you that have ordered from him I'm sure you've seen it <laughs> well he must have heard me last time so last time uh, 
Last time he sent a sketch and it was of a smoking baby. Or that's what I pulled out of the pack. And he must have remembered I pulled it. Because he put the smoking baby on that, man. And that's really cool. And he did his signature little booger on the uh, bag. I think he calls these barf bags. Because I guess they're barf bags. This dude is awesome. Shout out to GP Gay Nick. Make sure you're following him on social media. Reach out to the dude, man. He's really down to earth. He's not overpriced. Uh, he probably will be in a few years. So that's pretty cool, man. Old sleeping baby right there with a the train coming to get him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. Look at that classic. That's awesome. I, I like the packaging as much as I like the sketches. So Shane and I went a little overboard and we ordered a bunch of stuff. What is this? <laughs> no way, dude. He sent us some old school glasses. I'm tempted to put these on and see. I think it's for this. It is. It is. It makes this envelope 3D, man. GPK Nick, you are the man, dude. Um, I don't know. You guys going to be able to see that? Probably not. <laughs> but that's pretty cool, man. GPK Nick, shout out, bud. You know I'm going to troll you again on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram. But that's pretty cool. It makes it 3D. All right, we're going to get to this, and I'm going to try and be gentle again because, I mean, the Frying Brian is beautiful. Um, so we're going to try our best not to damage this when we pull off the tape. Um, he does a great job of securing the package too, man. Like, you don't have to worry about your items being damaged in transit. He takes the extra time uh, and care and TLC, but make sure you do when opening this. Like, I could rip this thing right open, but, I mean, I have original sketches on pretty much everything here. Um, so we're going to do our best not to damage the packaging because he takes so much time to actually give you more than what you're asking for. Uh, and I think that's one of the reasons I like it, man. Not to mention his artwork is just killer. So, all right, here we go. So, Fry and Brian, GPK Nick, I'm going to ask Shane if I could have that and uh, frame that, man. Because it's a really cool little pin drawing. So, Shane and I ordered a ton of, uh, of sketch cards from him. Oh, don't rip it, don't rip it. And I'm sorry, guys, this is going to take a minute because I'm trying to be delicate and not damage the packaging whatsoever. Um, like I said, he tapes the hell out of these, which protects your, uh, your items. So I try and take the time to make sure I don't mess up the hard work. So if you see, you see the bubble gum sketched on the mummy, that one's mine. I wanted that one. That bad boy is sick. So give me a second here. I probably should have tried to take this out of the package, but the package reveal is just, just as cool. Mm, I ripped it a little, just as cool as the cards. Um, to be honest with you, I mean, who doesn't want 17 sketches when they order, you know, four? <laughs> so the Fry and Brian's sick, man. I'm going to try and see if Shane will uh, let me keep that one. All right. There's round one of that. And then we've got more tape on here. So good God. Nick, my guy. Ugh. Trying my best here. Trying to make sure the video doesn't last forever, but at the same time not damaging it. I do apologize, guys. Um, but I am a collector and a fan. So I, I'm sure you understand. You don't want stuff damaged either. So bear with me as I peel off the first. Okay. All right. So here we go. I wanted that one. That's the smoker. And it looks like a sepia. I think he uses watercolors to make those. So it's a beautiful card. Beautiful, beautiful card. Okay. And we've got quite a few more on here. These I could peel off because they're on plastic. Okay. All right. There's the dunce. Beautiful, man. Another one of those like coffee stained watercolors. And then the mummy with the gum on it. That's really sick. That is really, really sick. Okay. So there's those three, and I think Shane ordered, I can't remember, I think, I know the dunce and the mummy were definitely mine. I have to have Shane go back through his text messages 
um, and see which ones he ordered. Because I think the Razor one I ordered too, or maybe Shane added that to the order. I can't remember, man. But, you know, Shane and I are big fans and collectors, so why not? And, again, it looks like uh, Nick threw in some of his, like, marketing cards with his Instagram on the back and quotes and all of that, and he did. So here we go. Oh, I think the glasses are for that one, too. And that one's definitely Shane's. The old pencil up the nose booger picker and the old razor face. And that is, man... That's So this is one of the ones where he peels off and then draws on it, and that's pretty sick. And then that is one of those 3Ds. So, And then these are his... Wow, he sent us three this time. These are his personal sketches with the quotes on the back. Your fear of looking stupid is holding you back. Don't let your knowledge stand in the way of the truth. Things get hairy from time to time. All autographed, sketched out, hand-drawn, man. Um, GPK Nick, huge shout out. Stay woke, people. Make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you, here, if you want, there's GPK Nick's Instagram. He's also on Facebook. He's in a lot of the groups. He's also on uh, Twitter. I believe he's on Twitter. I think I tagged him in Twitter. So make sure you're uh, following him. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And until next time, Pack Peelers is out.